We spend a lot of money on our model airplanes. And the last thing we want to do is cause damage to the wings when the plane's not even flying. So in this episode, I bought both the 30cc and 50cc sized custom padded wing bags from Extreme Flight RC. And we're gonna unbox the 50cc version and just show you what they're made of, get some close up views of what the inside is and just give you an idea that uh, these wing bags are available. So on the 50cc bags, I'll be using those for my new Black Horse Models Gilmore Redline, which I'll have a link to my build series on. And the 30cc bag I'll be using for my Seagull Perestroika, which I will also uh, link to my build video series on. So guys, thanks for tuning in. I love wing bags and hope you enjoy this video. So here is the box with the 50cc wing bags. This is how it comes in the mail. And in fact, this is how Extreme Flight gets them off of the container. They're already packaged up. So just a word to the wise, if you order multiple wing bags, you're going to get multiple shipments from the carrier that they choose. They're not gonna combine multiple wing bags into a single box just because they're already boxed from the factory. So we'll pull this out and the wing bag is folded very nicely and wrapped in this plastic wrapper. We'll get this off and pull it out and unfold it for you. There are three things I want to point out. First is that there are two sets of straps and if you notice they're stitched all the way down and around the bottom, not just stitched halfway down, they're stitched all the way down. So that's the first cool thing. Second thing is the zippers go down around the corners on the sides on both the on both sides. So it's not just across the top. Sometimes that's a little bit hard to to get a wing in, but right here you see me unzipping it from around the corner and to fully open it, you can go down down the side a little bit. Really cool on the zippers. On the inside, we have a nice padded felt and a padded felt divider to separate the wings. And here is the wing tube bag on the front, little pocket. And if you saw on the back side, there's the pocket for the side force generators. So as I said, I needed a nice set of uh, wing bags for my 92 inch Gilmore Redline from Black Horse Models. So I think this fit the bill. So I just want to show you what this looks like going in. And it's a little awkward because I'm doing it on a bench for a camera, so pardon that, but I always make sure that when I set wings in a wing bag that I have the servos and the servo hardware facing away from the inside. So if two wings are next to each other, that hardware doesn't have the opportunity to, to poke into the other wing. But there, I just wanted to show you that side force generator pocket. Obviously the Gilmore doesn't have side force generators, so maybe like a small field box, or sometimes you put screws or nuts and bolts or connectors in a servo box for that particular plane or whatever. Really nice pocket for the model. So again, that nice padded velour divider keeps the wing separate and the nice big zippers go around the corners and there you go, as long as you don't accidentally <laughs> crimp in the servo extension we have these nice 50cc wing bags. We'll go ahead and get the, the wing tube and slide it in there. Right here is a good shot to see those, the straps that go all the way down and around the entire bag. So let's go out to the field and here's a shot of the, the Gilmore in the back of my car with the wing bag and um, yes, I'm using this uh, at the field. So really great wing bag. I'm really happy with it. So I also got the 30cc wing bag and I wanted to show you what I'm having. I wanted to show you what wings I'm using in here. This is the Seagull Perestroika. Again, it doesn't have to be. These are extreme flight wing bags. It doesn't have to be an extreme flight or 3D hobby shop plane. But if you need wing bags, uh, this is a great option. So here's just an example. It's about a 30, 35 cc plane and the Yak 11 wings are tapered, tapered out. 
they get larger at the root. So you'll see as I zip this up, it's it's a little awkward. You just have to situate those rings, wings a little bit. But um, just wanted to show you the 35cc size of this padded wing bag from Extreme Flight. Everything else is the same. The straps, the zippers around the edge, wing tube, side force generator pocket, everything. And of course, I do have, you guys know, you guys know I have Extreme Flight and 3D Hobby Shop planes. Here's my 3D Hobby Shop 75 Edge that I have another set of wing bags for. But uh, guys, thanks for tuning in. If you need wing bags, I love wing bags. So I guess they're my version of a purse. But if you guys need wing bags, I hope you look into these Extreme Flight padded wing bags and we will see you next time.